If you are a healthcare professional or a hand nerd like me, and you're interested in learning more about hand anatomy and how your hand moves, then you're gonna wanna try these anatomy software gloves. Hi guys, I'm Michelle from Virtual Hand Care, and on my channel, I make a lot of hand exercise videos. So I know quite a bit about hand and arm anatomy, but with so many muscles and tendons and ligaments and nerves of the hand and the wrist, it can be hard to remember what inserts where and what muscle does what action. There is nothing better than being able to develop a 3D understanding of our hand structures. Looking at illustrations or, or photos or using an app on your phone can be very helpful with learning anatomy. However, it's just not the same as drawing it on your hand and actually drawing it at the exact insertion and the exact origin and then you physically moving so you can see how that muscle works that's what actually helps you retain the information at least that's what it does for me so first i'm going to thank anatomy software international for helping me refresh my hand anatomy so let's head on over to anatomysoftware.com to learn more so how this works is you're going to pick a language so first you want to pick whichever language is your native language that's the wonderful thing about this anatomy software is it is available in four different languages and this glove is actually shipped anywhere in the whole entire world no matter where you are you can still learn your hand anatomy so I'm gonna pick English and so then you're gonna come down here and pick your dominant hand now I am right hand dominant. So as you can see, this shows right hand dominant. And so I'm gonna actually receive a glove for my left hand. Why it's important to pick your hand dominance is because you are going to be drawing on your non-dominant hand. Most people are not the best drawers or writers with their non-dominant hand. So you do wanna make sure that you put your hand dominance in so that you can get the correct glove and then you're going to want to choose if you want one year video access or two year video access and what this means is that you get 12 step-by-step -step video tutorials and each of these will go over bones joints surface anatomy all of the wrist extensors all of your wrist flexors thumb extensors and thumb flexors finger flexors. And I like how these videos are very helpful with understanding the very complicated dorsal apparatus on the back of our fingers. And of course you can play and pause and repeat and you can do that over and over for a year or you can get two years of access. And so two years access, you're looking at $39.99 US dollars. And for virtual hand care only viewers, you will get a special 10% discount if you enter the discount code VHC10OFF at your checkout. So go ahead and grab that special link in the description box below. Now, one thing to keep in mind, this glove is a one size fits all glove. I normally wear an extra small, so as you can tell, it's a pretty good fit for me. I do wish it was just a little bit smaller just so there weren't as many wrinkles when I was drawing on this. However, for most of you, I think this would be just a fine fit. And something else to keep in mind is that Anatomy Software recommends you to use fine tipped Sharpies. If you use more thick markers, then that's gonna be a little bit of a mess, I think. You're gonna really have a hard time differentiating those anatomical structures so you can truly understand the origin and insertion. And you'll wanna make sure that you get a variety of colors of Sharpie. So you can differentiate between all of these muscles and tendons in the hand. Now with that though, because you're using a Sharpie, this is a one-time use only. I have not washed it to see if you could reuse it, but because I'm using permanent marker, I'm pretty sure it's probably just gonna be a one time. So you may want to order additional gloves. Now, I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please give it a like and don't forget to hit that subscribe button below and keep an eye out for more videos where I'm gonna go actually into a lot more detail about the anatomy of our flexors on the palmer side of our hand, but also the anatomy on the dorsal side of the hand and how 
all of that works together to help us do so many fine motor movements to very large movements with our hands. Thanks for watching.